Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Meliza. I just want to do a quick little haul. Um, I received this stamp set from Betty Kilroy from her um, entry for my giveaway and I thought it was so stinking cute. So I really wanted to try their um, stamps and products. So I finally took the splurge and purchased some things. I got a little too excited and cut into the packaging. So let's see what I got. Let's see if the invoice has the prices. Because I know like I want to know the prices of everything. And it does have the price. So I'll let you guys know what I uh, what I paid. Oh my gosh, this is so funny that this is the first stamp on top. Um, Eileen and I always joke around saying that we have the brain toots, and I thought this was so stinking funny and so cute. So they do have a lot of um, funny um, adult um, stamps in their store as well. So I had to grab this one. Sorry, I had a major brain fart, full-blown brain fart kind of day total. Whoops. Thank goodness, brain farts don't smell. In progress, pew, master of brain fartery. Wait, what? Uh oh, and pfft. that is so stinky cute. And I think this is the only like random stamp that I got, but this right here, it's it's a comic book theme. I don't know if if you guys don't follow me on um, Instagram, I did a little ATC card. Um, using one of those um, images from Tipsy Tiffany, Tipsy Color. I used um, her comic book girls and I kind of made like a pop art comic book theme little ATC card. And I want to do a full on comic book um, pocket letter. Sorry, you guys. See, I'm this is why I, I got this because I always have. The brain toots. So um, yeah, I wanted to do a full pocket letter comic book theme. Um, this is one of the uh, dice sets I got through AliExpress. And there was another one that I got that it's somewhere on my shelf. But this is the first thing that I saw that I wanted to show you guys. The BAM and this is some other uh, comic book related dice that I got through Ali. But um, Anna, she has this newer pocket letter die set that almost looks like a postage stamp and it comes with two different sizes. So this is the ATC size little card. So those are like the little layering pieces and then you get a smaller one as well. I really wish she had um, more of this one in stock. I really like this one because it comes with a little pocket to, and all of these little extras that little oomph to your pocket letter. But um, yeah, I really want to do a pocket letter swap um, down the road eventually. So I have these dies just in case. So make sure you go visit Anna's store and pick up. Because I know a lot of you guys didn't know what ATC cards were. I just learned about them. Um, last year so I'm still pretty new at it and um, I really I had fun um, making this little uh, yeah mini pocket letter here goes that little pocket piece where you could stick little goodies for your friends but yeah I want to do a, a comic book theme one and I'm just rambling on so this stamp set let me see $14.99 for this. And then um, this one. So this one's called Brain Fart. This one's going to be Gossip Girls. And Gossip Girls is $14.99. I love the images. For some reason, I thought they were going to be a little bit bigger, but um, they're still a good size. No way, you're that old. Shh. 
It's a surprise. Did you hear? Oh my gosh. You have how many stamps? Shocker. What the what now? Oh no, huh? And then you got the little words that say. So, yep. Thought that was cute. And um, yeah, it doesn't matter if that they're bigger because this will be perfect for a pocket letter. Cute. Oh, this is not comic book related. Um, this one's called Boing. And this one was on clearance for $5.99. So that's why I got it. And I seen someone make a card with this um, last year and I thought it was, um, I, would, I wouldn't say cute because there's nothing cute about this image, but it's really scary, killer clown, chasing Santa. Boing bong, no, 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 bong, Halloween, it's my Christmas. When people start posting Christmas cards before it's Halloween, <laughs> talking about Christmas before it's Halloween. Very cute. And I want to say I got the, yeah, so um, this was $5.99. And once again, this is Boing, and then the Boing outline dies were was only 99 cents. This was on clearance. So that was the only steal of the deal, steal of a deal that I got. Um, let's see. This one, I don't remember getting this one, but I have this one. Weird O frame die set. Hmm. I don't know why I got this one, but it was $20. Uh, I don't know. I probably passed out while purchasing that, but I got that. Um, this one is called Comic Burst A2 die set. So the uh, cute little card front, comic book style. And it is, this was $20. This one is $12.99 and this is called Poof board die set. Okay, this is a, a little rubber stamp. And this is the image that you get. It's called Comic Book Page. And it was $14.99. And then I got their comic book. Book, um, six by six paper. Well, let's see the quality and let's see the prints. So you get two of each um, designer paper. Was the paper and the paper was $8.99 and then I got the little dot stencil let's see what it's called um, comic half tone stencil and um, this one was $7.99 and then I got these um, Slimline cornered rectangle die. And this was $7.99. This is probably on sale as sale as well. $7.99. I love to get um what are these called? Eee, brain toots. Nesting shaped dies. <laughs> is that what it's called? Yeah, like nesting dies. I love to get um, different shapes 
and especially I'm trying to stock up on some slimline ones and this one just has the um, cut corners. So got that. That's a good price, $7.99 for some dies, right? Um, so go check out Wincy Stamps. I just wanted to stick with one theme because um, I wanted to do a comic book pocket letter die. Or do a comic book theme pocket letter. There you go. Go check out Anna's shop for the pocket letter die that she has. And I don't know if I told you what it's called. The newest one is called um, pocket letter die set of two. So go check that out. And don't forget to use a code for that. Um, next is from Stamp Stamp anything stamp anything uh. hmm. Let's see. this one I cannot tell you the prices of everything but um, her stamps and her die sets the coordinating die sets is such they're, they're so affordable it's like why not get the uh, the die set with your stamp so affordable in my opinion I don't know so she just had a new release you guys let me just try to they're in two separate um, packaging is because I didn't know that she when she does a release um, she released a couple of things one day and then the next day it's she releases um, another item and then yeah I don't know it's so confusing just put it all out in one time please but so I don't know if she did like a it's like a three day, three day thing or a two day thing, but like she releases cards up for her release. It's for Clueless. That's what I'm trying to say. It is a Clueless themed release. So here goes Cher. You're such a Betty, uh, as if, and her coordinating die. Here goes Dion. I forgot your birthday. I'm so clueless. Isn't that a cute sentiment? And look at her pose with her brick cell phone. So stinking cute. And here goes Ty. From all your homies, I'm totally bugging. So stinking cute. And then the dies that she released was this as if clueless die set. And this really cute um, little locker die set as well. And of course, there's like some stencils, I believe, too. So, yeah, go check out the newer release for that. Um, and then other stuff that I got. This was on clearance. I don't know how much it cost. Um, but here is the name of it. It was a couple bucks. Uh, hope your day was um, Triceratops. The coordinating die. I want to say it was like a dollar or two. Like, why not? And then this Lana Al Aloha one. That was really cute. The coordinating die. Clarence. So I grabbed that. And I don't know, okay, this is a gatefold mini album. Okay, so here goes the page, and it makes a little mini album. I don't know how much I paid for it. It was just one of those things I just added, added to, to my cart. So this is really a mini, mini album. So there goes my haul. 
And speaking of, speaking of any stamp, stamp anything is having a little virtual retreat that I signed up for and paid for. So I got my retreat swag bag and items that we're going to be crafting um, on the retreat. So I kind of figured we could open it up together if you guys are interested. I think she told someone that there's a few spots open. She has some kits left over, a couple of kits. So um, go head over to her uh, Facebook page or reach out through Instagram um, and email her. She does have spots left. Here is the package. Let's open it up. I'm just scared I'm going to cut through something. Let's see. And I think um, this retreat is the last weekend of the month, I believe. I'm not sure. I think so. So as you can see... It's going to be a Power Puff Girl themed little retreat. And she supplies everything, the stamps, the dies. So we'll go through it. We'll go through it. Look at this. So here goes the stamps. Suck it up. Cheer up, Buttercup. Hope your day is Bubbles of fun, my love for you, friendship <clears throat> continues to blossom. The sky's the limit. Stop monkeying around. Sugar spice, everything nice. Have a great day. Look at these little mini Powerpuff Girls. So let's flip her over. Oh. So it looks like we're going to be doing a bingo. And it has my name on there. Oh, nice. So look, you guys. It's going to be so easy to follow along because each stamped image, it has all the colors you need to um, color your stamped image. Isn't that neat? I don't have Copics, so I do have to... Um, do my, some homework to coordinate um, my Ohuhus to some of these um, Copic colors. And plus, the ones that Sandra gifted me would probably um, work with some of these skin tone ones. So, isn't that cool? Wow. And then all you have to do is just keep this in the envelope and keep it handy. And this could be a little um, color chart reference if you're coloring a different image as well. So, um, yeah, here goes the stamp set with the dies in the back if you don't see. And these are a good size. So much fun. And um, this is one of the projects we're going to be doing. It's going to be a tag mini album. Fun. What is this? We get this little tool. Uh, comment down below. What is this? I don't know. Got that. Some girl power metal charms. Some jemmies. More jemmies. Some sort of little silicone mat. I wonder if this is for like your ink pad so it won't move around. Hmm. 
got that. She did a survey too to see like what color um, power puff or character um, you like. And I chose green for um, Buttercup. So I think she tried to cater to whatever um, color you liked. Oh, that's so cute. A little Powerpuff Girl keychain. I think the only downside, if you do want to take up one of the spots, you probably have to pay the full amount up front. Um, whereas in the beginning, it was split into like four or five payments. And I, I think I did mine in three payments. So a lot of jummies to embellish your projects. I want to say that it is a two-day retreat and I think we make three projects. I'm not sure. Little tool. A cute little pen with the star on top. Got some taffy in here. Oh, this is so cute. A little um, hand sanitizer. Oh, it's Puff Powerpuff Girl hand sanitizer. Very cute. Let's open it up. Oh, it's just a bottle, so you can fill it up with your own hand sanitizer, body spray, whatever you like. Isn't that cute? that um oh yeah so you do get like stencils so let's see what stencils we got half tone dot stencil sunburst stencil so this will be perfect for my um comic book stuff that i want to do comic stencil background ray stencil and more of a comic book scene stencil right there. And she included all the cardstock that we need. And this is some nice, like, textured cardstock. Six by six. More jennies. Look at that. Fun. So, oh, these are the projects that we have, we're gonna do gonna be doing. Oh, these are sealed up. I'll probably just leave them sealed up and be surprised um, when I do it, but in here it looks like it has all the pieces that we need to make this mojo jojo um, flip card sky's the limit this is a little treat box another card A wiper card. This is going to be for our mini tag, our mini album. Eep. Looks like there's like wood chips in here or something. I don't want to. There's something. Not wood chip. But I'm super excited to get into this. And this is gonna be a gift card holder. This is pretty big. I wonder what's inside here. A cute little um, pencil pouch with her logo. More um, patterned paper. This 
single-sided. Got some foam squares. Oh, and this die set that says uh, Power Girl. Oh, another little thing. And some metal charms right here with all the Powerpuff Girls. So stinking cute. And another project. Wow, that is a lot. It's gonna be so much fun. So it looks like we are doing one, two, three, four, five, six, seven projects in the two day weekend retreat. Everything is included, we just need your markers, scissors, glue, what have you, and whatever extra embellishments that you need, but they provide all the stencils, the dies, the paper. It looks like everything's like pre-cut for you in here. So uh, I'm super excited. I hope, I hope, I hope that we get to color together so I can learn some techniques. I'm not sure if we're supposed to color these stamped images beforehand I have to go check the, out the Facebook page but um, yeah make sure you follow stamp anything Facebook page and you'll have all the information how to sign up if you want to join but that was a lot of stuff get the swag bag with all these little goodies plus everything you need for the retreat so um, yep I want to just do this quick little haul and I just wanted to share with you guys what I got for my little retreat bag. I'm super excited to do my first little retreat. Um, speaking of retreats, the Crafty Girls, that was my first little virtual crafty retreat and that was on a Zoom meeting with 20 plus girls. That was so much fun. Um, but this one's gonna be different. It's just like a Facebook thing. I don't think we're gonna be interacting with anyone. I think just through the chat probably, but um, still, I think that's gonna be fun as well. That's it. Um, thank you guys for tuning in. I'll catch you guys on the next crappy video. Bye.